hey i want this to be more conversational as possible as we can there's this norm that a man must not chase a woman my question to you is where did you hear that from how did you come about that and if that's your belief hmm, what are you actually doing about that hi my name is Kwecho and you are welcome back to my channel in today's conversation I'm going to talk about if you don't chase how will you find it listen there's a natural phenomenon that says that the things you chase they run away from you but the problem is the kind of things we are chasing and how we are chasing them is what definitely is going to run away from us but listen for a woman every man is allowed to chase her i'm going to give you two scenarios two examples and why i believe that a man must chase a woman listen to this except you don't want to be in a relationship except you don't want to get married except you don't want to be with a woman then then don't don't chase a woman accept that but if you want to be in a relationship if you want to get married if you want to be with a woman which is the natural order that a man and a woman definitely by all means by all stretch by by all standard they will by all means click and meet and be with each other and whatever that happens at the end you give yourself to these two reasons and you'll be fine now listen the first scenario i want to give you is this it says that as a man thinketh in his heart so is he i want to ask you a question based on this belief that a man mustn't chase a woman since you have been thinking about that since you have put your mind and yourself and a thought in that place how has it been for you have you met a woman have you found one yet are you in a relationship how is your relationship going ah are you married how is your marriage going are you with a woman how is that going since you have had that thought you probably would have to rewire or rethink on that thought second scenario listen listen there are things that you a man generally you mustn't chase and here's why earlier i said that many times we chase the wrong things here's why this second scenario is about you yourself as a man you see you must seek to add value to yourself it is for you it is about you when you do that you are making yourself feel better you are making yourself feel good you are making yourself be attractive for yourself in essence whatever you do that you want to do to impress somebody to get that person do it to impress yourself first do it for you do everything you do for you and let it be about you first and once you are in that place and in that torch all of the other things that you are thinking you should be chasing would actually won't see or seem as something you have to chase so focus on yourself as a man find your purpose find your passion be more be more of a man of confidence and integrity be, be of a man of value be of a man of influence be you be original be genuine first and all of these things for yourself not for anybody not for anybody i repeat once you do this your mind is clear and you are level-headed with your view of life your view of relationship your view of marriage and in general your view of women third scenario <laughs> this is a very beautiful piece i was reading and i came across the word brought you know when there's a saying that a woman was brought before man 
and man chose. The word brought for my findings means to parade. Now listen, as a man or a woman, but my emphasis, is, my emphasis and focus is on a man. As a man, a lot of women are being paraded before you. They are always passing by. Some are your friends, some are your work colleagues, some are whatever you call them. Listen, listen. Your place there is to choose one. Let me go quickly to my third scenario. Listen, the third scenario says that, and that explains further of what I said, except you are not interested in being in a relationship, except you are not interested in being married, except you are not interested in being with a woman, then listen to this, then this is not for you. But if it's your view, then this is for you. Why you must chase a woman? Listen, it says that he who finds a wife finds a good thing. Now listen, the word find means a lot of things. It means to come forth with. You know what the word comfort with means? It also means to, to pursue hard after. <laughs> listen, listen, this is, this is a natural order. The natural order says that in finding a woman, you must chase and overtake. That's what it means. How do you not chase something if you have to overtake that thing? Let's get it clear. If you think what I'm saying is not reasonable, leave it in the comment. But, but listen, it says you must, you must pursue hard after. Hey, you must pursue with passion. On. Like chase and overtake. That's what the word find means. So at the end of the day, you're going to find just that one woman. And that finding, your bit to find that one woman is to chase that woman. Is to go hard after that woman. Is to go is to come forth with that woman. In, no, in essence, fight all the fights, fight all the battles, go at all length and cost to get that woman. So if you're sitting there, you say, oh, I don't have to chase, no, because I mean, somebody says I don't have to chase woman, I mean, out of the day. It's the perspective and the approach to the perspective that is wrong. You get me? So, to find that woman, you must chase. Now listen to the final point and scenario. The final point and scenario says, for this cause shall a man leave the father and mother and shall cleave to the wife. Okay. If your interest as a man is to find a woman and a wife, then here's your point. It says that cleave to the wife. Now the word cleave there means simply means chase. It also connotes to overtake. Now listen. The place of a man is to find. So women stop finding. You are in the wrong direction. You are heading towards the wrong direction. The place of a man is to chase and find you. The place of a man is to look for you and grab you and take you. But your place as a woman is to position yourself at the right place where he can find you. That is just it. So if all you are doing, listen, I get it when some woman says that they don't chase, they attract. It's good. That is it. That's the right perspective. That's the right, a right view to start with. You don't have to chase as a woman. You have to only attract. And in attracting, you have to look beautiful and good. See, it is by what we see that moves us as men. So you must look good. You must look better. And in all these that I've said, position yourself as a woman at the right place. And that man who is supposed to chase you will find you. So if you think you don't have to chase as a man, then you better rethink. And if you, your woman, you think you don't have to attract, you better have to rethink. So here's why, and this brings me to an end, to why I believe that every single man, once you are interested in relationship and in marriage, you must chase that woman. Because if you don't chase her, somebody else is going to chase her and overtake her. <laughs>
<laughs> and make her his wife or his girlfriend. That brings me to the end of today's conversation. Thanks for watching. If you liked that video, kindly subscribe to the channel and help me share with your friends and contacts and click the likes, click the notification. And let's see you in the comments interacting. Peace out.